Hey, what's up, everyone? Same time gaming here. Welcome back from the Division 2 Weekly Vendor Reset. Well, guys, we are here at the White House, so let's just get rid of these vendors. So the first named item we have here is the Zero F, the Badget Health chess piece. The Max Star has protection here, which is really nice. So uh, if you're into that, if you're a new player, you can definitely buy this and extract it. Comes with the perfect unbreakable talent, of course. Uh, then we have the MP5 ST SMG with 10.5 SMG damage, 13.5 crit chance, 3.5 rate of fire, say this is the talent. A Socom MK16 Assault Rifle with 10.8 uh, Assault Rifle damage, 15% health damage, 7% crit chance and reformation is the talent. The military M9 pistol with 10.8% uh, pistol damage, 8.7% reload speed and steady handed is the talent. A Petro Defense Group backpack with 10.9% weapon damage, 7.3 skill damage, 4.9 crit chance and tech support is the talent. A Wyvern Rare chess piece with focus talent here and 10.1% skill haste, 16.1% repair skill. Uh, offensive system mod, which is 4.5% crit chance, a drone mod, which is 6.8% effect duration, a uh, turret mod, which is 6% duration, and a sticky launcher mod, which is 4% burn uh, duration here. So yeah, that's it for this White House vendor. All right, guys, we're here at the clan's vendor, so let's take a look. Uh, the named item we have is the Night Watcher, which is named Gilligat Mask, uh, with 124,757 armor, 100% scanner pulse taste, of course, and 8.5% hazard protection. Then we have the True Patriot Mask with 134,852 armor, 7.9% explosive resistance, a tip of the spear mask with 14.4, 8% uh, weapon damage and 3.6% critical hit chance. So yeah, if you're looking for tip of the spear mask, definitely pick it up, it's really high. Uh, then we have the Eclipse Protocol Gloves with plus one skills here, 10.3% skill haste, an AUG-8-3 power SMG, 12.4% um, SMG damage, 16% crit chance, 8% damage to target out of cover, and unwavering is the talent. A Socom MK20 Marksman Rifle with maxed out health damage, future for the talent, 86% uh, headshot damage, and 9.5% is the Marksman Rifle damage. Uh, MP7 SMG with unwavering, 12.7% swap speed, 17.5 crit chance, 10.2 SMG damage. A USC45 um, Rifle with insane talent, 3.9% rate of fire, 13% critical hit damage, 11.5 rifle damage. A 612 Shotgun with spike talent, 9.1 accuracy, 9% damage to armor, 12.4 shotgun damage. A Providence chest piece with entrenched talent, maxed out crit chance, 5.8 headshot damage, 12.1 weapon damage. Um, Fenris Group knee pads with 11.3% critical hit damage, 16,699 health, 11% weapon damage. A utility system mod, which is 16.8% uh, repair skill. A sticky bomb mod, which is 5.1% blast radius. A trap mod, which is 4.5% duration. And last, we have a turret mod, which is 4.3% burn damage. So that's it for the clan's vendor. All right, guys, we're here at the theater settlement. So the named item we have here, the mop shotgun uh, with armor damage here, of course, the I mean, sorry, armor on kill, 11% damage to armor, 10.1% shotgun damage and ignited is the talent. It's a pretty decent one in terms of attributes. You can definitely buy this to max out in the uh, next update in 2.12 uh, if you don't own a better one than this. And you can change the talent to whatever you want. Uh, next, we have the military M870 shotgun with vindictive talent, 7.9% accuracy, 9% damage to armor, 9.9% shotgun damage. Then we have the M16A rifle uh, with 10.8% rifle damage, 11% crit damage, 8% magazine size, future perfect talent, and ultimate ornaments gloves, plus one skill tier, 10% skill haze, 16,340 health, a circle of concern knee pads, 11.3 weapon damage. 10.9% critical hit damage and 8.2% hazard protection. Pretty decent one, I would say. We can definitely buy this and max it out because it's in circle of a new path, so you can definitely use it in a SMG build with hazard here. So it's already have crit damage and weapon damage. Uh, this will definitely be useful in future, like T12 update where you can max out stats. And next we have the defensive protocol stamina mod, which is 8.3% bleed resistance. Uh, Seeker mine mod, which is 4.2% damage. A shield mod, which is plus one damage bonus per enemy. Uh, Firefly mod, which is 5.8% skill haste, a decoy mod, which is 6% duration. So yeah, that's it for theater. Alrighty, guys, we're here at the campus settlement. So the named item we have here is the Kim's Long Stick uh, with Perfect Ranger, 9% uh, critical hit damage, 80% headshot damage, 10.1% maximum rifle damage, a surplus SBD uh, with Lucky Shot talent, 8.5% magazine size, 100 101% headshot damage and 10.4% maximum rifle damage. Infantry MG5 with 11.5% LMG damage, 9% damage to target out of cover, 5% crit chance, and Optimus is the talent. A group of summer mask with maxed out weapon damage and 4.6% crit chance with uh, 8.1 critical hit damage. So it's definitely, you can pick it up. I mean, you keep the crit chance the way it is, max out the critical hit damage, and the next update you can definitely max out the crit chance. So you'll have a god roll uh, group of mask here. So it's, it's a definitely a nice one. Uh, then we have the Bellstone Armory Holster with 154,745 armor, 
8.4% status effect, 7.3% hazard protection, uh, utility system mod, which is 8.2% uh, skill duration, uh, chem launcher mod, plus one ammo, uh, uh, hive mod, which is 7.9% health, a pulse mod, which is 6.4% cone size, a trap mod, which is 5.8% duration. So yeah, that's it for uh, the campus element. Alrighty, guys, we're here in DZ East. So the named item we have here is the Kim's Log Stick again, um, with perfect ranger, of course, and 9.5 magazine size, 89% headshot damage, 9.1% uh, maximum rifle damage, a hunting M44, uh, maximum rifle, 11% maximum rifle damage, 93% headshot damage, 9% magazine size, ranger is the talent. It's pretty much the same like this, right? Then we have the Black Market RPK LMG with 11.7% uh, LMG damage, 9% damage to target that they've covered, 9% magazine size. Uh, Ignited is the talent. Looks like they like the nine numbers a lot this time. Okay, we have Aces and Ace Mask with 10.8% uh, weapon damage, 15% repair skill, a Hunter Fury holster with 11.7% weapon damage, 6.2 headshot damage, a Badger Tough Mask with 146,452 armor, 7.8% hazard detection, 15.8 repair skill, a 511 holster with 149,717 armor, 5.4% crit chance, 8.6 uh, skill haste, a utility system mod, which is 10% skill haste, um, chem launcher mod, which is 5.8% uh, skill haste, um, a hive mod, which is 4% range, pulse mod, which is 5% skill haste, a trap mod, which is 6% shock radius. So yeah, that's over DZ East. All right, guys, we're here at the DZ South. So let's take a look. The named item we have is Mozambique Special Pistol with perfect break basket, of course, 5% uh, damage to armor, 10.4% uh, pistol damage, P90 SMG with 9.9% SMG damage, 13.5 uh, crit chance, 3.5 rate of fire, and strain is the talent. A custom P416 G3 uh, assault rifle in sync, damage to target out of cover, 8%, 15.5 health damage, 11.3 assault rifle damage, uh, X45 pistol with salvage talent, 5% damage to armor, 11% pistol damage, a tip of the spear backpack with 10.8% weapon damage, 10.1% critical hit damage, an eclipse protocol chest piece with plus one skill tier, 10.2% skill haste, a 511 tactical backpack with maxed out weapon handling, combined arm is the talent, some armor region here and armor force, pretty low, a Fenris group chest piece which has glass cannon uh, talent with 10.5% crit damage, 10% 10.5% skill haste and 10.6% weapon damage, uh, offensive system mod, which is 7.2% headshot damage, a drone mod, which is 6.5% duration, a turret mod, which is 4.2% damage, a uh, sticky bomb mod, which is 4.3% skill haste. So yeah, that's for DZ South. Alrighty guys, final dark zone here, DZ West. So the named item we have is Baker Dozen uh, with perfect lucky shot, 8.8% stability, 13% crit damage, 10.4 rifle damage, uh, Super 90 shotgun with 10.6% shotgun damage, 9% damage to armor, 8.5 reload speed, say this is the talent, a 6716 uh, rifle uh, with 15% rifle damage, 11% crit damage, 5% damage to armor, Optimus is the talent, a future initiated gloves with skill tier, 4.3% skill haste, a striker's knee pads with 10.6% weapon damage, 6.5 weapon handling, a badger of gloves with 108 1,018 armor uh, with 7% weapon handling, 6.5 skill damage, a circle of concern, um, knee pads with 11.6% weapon damage, 3.3 critical hit chance, 8.7% status effect, defensive protocol stamina mod, which is 8.2% bleed resistance, uh, the secret mind mod, which is 6.5 health damage, a shield mod, which is 4% damage bonus per enemy, a firefly mod, which is plus one max target, decoy mod with 6% duration. So let's go to New York. All right, guys, we're here at New York at Haven Settlement. So let's take a look what Roy Benitez has. Uh, the military AKM assault rifle with fast and talent, 9% stability, 13% health damage, 9.6 assault rifle damage. The M249 LMG with 11% LMG damage, 8% damage to target out of cover, 7% crit chance and fast hand is the talent. The 1886 rifle with killer uh, damage to target out of cover, 8%. 12% uh, critical hit damage, 11% rifle damage. I'm actually gonna buy this one if I have space. Yeah, I do. Uh, because in the new feature, we'll be able to max it into uh, 12, and then I can change the talent and maybe keep it like this. It's a really strong rifle, so definitely uh, recommend buying it uh, for the future. Then we have the Police uh, 686 Magnum Pistol with Optimist Talent, 9.7% accuracy, 10.5% uh, pistol damage, uh, Overload Ornaments Chest Piece with 9.2% weapon damage, 10.8% skill haste, 3.9% crit chance, a braced is the talent, a Gilligord knee pads with 111, 198 armor, 8.1% hazard protection, 17.5% uh, repair skill, a badge of mask with 124,967 armor, 3.7% uh, critical hit chance, 9% explosive resistance, 
a defensive system mod, which is 8.5% lead resistance, um, offensive protocol mod, which is 7.4% uh, headshot damage, a drone mod, which is 6.4% deflect duration, a pulse mod, which is 4.9 skill haste, a decoy mod, which is 6% health. So yeah, that's it for our unit haste. All right, guys, we're here at the final vendor. So let's see, we have the police M4 here with 11% assault rifle damage, 15% health damage, 8.8% stability, and spike is the talent. The covert SRS maximum rifle with 11.3% maximum rifle damage, 94% headshot damage, 5% uh, damage to armor, reformation is the talent. The ACS-12 shotgun with 10% shotgun damage, 8% damage to armor, 8.5% accuracy, ignited is the talent. A D50 pistol with 11.3 pistol damage, 8% damage to... Uh, Critical hit damage. Uh, finisher is the talent. Richter and Kaiser backpack with plus one skill tier, 9.9% .9 skill haste, 9.9% .9 critical hit damage, and shock and awe is the talent. Um, circle of concern knee pads with 11.3 weapon damage, 8.6% status effect, 7.6% uh, headshot damage. Circle of concern holster with 10.2% weapon damage, 9.9% 9 .9 critical hit damage, 3,767 uh, armor region. A utility system mod, which is 10.1% skill haste. A utility protocol mod, which is 8.5% skill duration. A secret mind mod, which is 4.1% radius. A pulse mod, which is 6.5% cone size. And last, we have a trap mod, which is 4.2% of duration. So yeah, that's it for the uh, weekly vendor here, guys. I apologize if I was too fast, honestly, because I just wanted to get rid of these vendors. Uh, and uh, soon, I'm not going to be uh, doing division. I'm just going to be like playing other games on the channel. So I hope you guys will like that as well. So I'll talk about that in a different video, in a separate video. Uh, so yeah, that's basically it for the vendor. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for Cassie Mendoza Reset. Till then, peace.